What is going on guys and welcome to yet another FIFA 23 news show on my channel. As every video I try my best to deliver to you the latest and most accurate news about FIFA. So without further ado bring on the news. EA Sports is once again a Juventus partner. Juventus is not only an official sport video gaming partner but also official urban culture partner. Beyond gaming and football, there will be initiatives to experience Juve World. A world of street art, culture, music and urban lifestyle. Exclusive partnership starts with FIFA 23 and it will last for multiple years. If you go on the club's site, you can now see EA among the other partners of Juventus. Claudio Marchisio has been revealed as the fourth new FUD hero. Also, Dusan Vlahovic is announced as the new exclusive ambassador for FIFA 23. Juventus Stadium has been updated and you can notice it very clearly from this screen that appears multiple times throughout the Juventus announcement trailer. Other updated Serie A stadium is San Siro. We know that because the second set of ad boards has been added to the stadium. Small new feature revealed here is that you can now put a player behind the free kick wall. This is the official broadcast package of French Women's League. It is confirmed that there will be four women's leagues in FIFA 23. Those leagues are English, French, German and United States. Another important piece of info is that women's teams are not available in FUT or career mode. Goalnet is now a proper 3D asset. Now that next gen is on PC, the game will have a full support for Xbox and PlayStation controllers. Russian national team won't be in FIFA 23 or any Russian clubs. This is beta home screen revealed by DJ Mario. Omar da Fonseca and Benjamin da Silva are the new French commentary duo and they have been recording over a year now for FIFA. Campeone, campeone, olé, olé, olé. Je suis avec tout le peuple footballeur, le peuple argentin qui va faire la fête pendant 10 ans. Volveremos, volveremos, volveremos otra vez. Como en el 86, ali, ali, le. Oh, 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 il a, il a, Oh, oh, oh. Voilà, c'est vraiment dedans tout ça. Hypermotion 2 adds over 6,000 new animations and with over 4,000 from Hypermotion 1 it is over 10,000 new animations compared to old gen. Match day experience is improved from enhanced stadium atmosphere, hyper realistic pitch surfaces and augmented reality broadcast replays. Sliding marks are deeper now and stay throughout the whole match. Official gameplay trailer will be out today and the length of the video is 11 minutes and 33 seconds. Here I'm reading off leaked notes. Training setter. A new coaching system helps you introduce new and less experienced players to the fundamentals of gameplay with a series of chapters to help you improve your game. Pick between the two FIFA 23 cover stars as you decide between Sam Kerr and Kylian Mbappe as your coach. Then hone your skills with recommended skill games to explore, including notes from your coach based on your performance and in-depth skill explanations that help you take your game to the next level. Net Interaction Physics New net physics reacts to the emotion of players, responding to individual limbs and creating more natural interactions with the net as players run, slide or fall into the goal. Power Shots a new skill-based risk versus reward shooting mechanism brings football's most powerful and impressive shots into the game. Create space away from defenders, pick your spot and trigger a power shot to add additional power to your strike and the chance of the spectacular. Accelerate. New acceleration mechanism provide a new layer of personality to help players reach their top speed in FIFA 23. From explosive acceleration of the mark to more controlled or lengthy changes of pace. Players will now reach their top speed at different rates to create more variety in player movement and gameplay in FIFA 23. Advanced Impact Physics 
Advanced impact physics makes players' individual limbs more naturally affect the outcome when defenders block the ball in FIFA 23. Deflections and blocks from defenders and goalkeepers' arms, legs, hands and even fingers will now have more realistic outcomes determined by the impact of the ball upon them. As they absorb the power of the shot to affect the ball's path and create more visually authentic deflections based on the speed and force of each individual strike. Redesigned set pieces. A set piece redesign gives you more control over free kicks, penalties, and corners, allowing you to choose where you make contact on the ball to change direction, trajectory, curl, and more. Plus, an update to camera positions on corners better reflects the drama of dead ball situations. And that's it for this video guys, please leave a like if you enjoyed the video and make sure to subscribe to stay up to date with latest FIFA news.